<sighs> Parfums the Marley. Mason Alhambra, Hercules. As you guys can tell, man, very similar to Parfums the Marley Harriet, but does it smell like Parfums the Marley Harriet? Well, today we'll find out, man. Stay tuned, stay locked. It's your boy Var from 20 Degrees in LA. Roll my clip. Traveling and we do vlog. Spoiler alert, this ain't game. YouTube! What it do, baby? It's your boy Var from Tony in LA. Here we talk about fragrance. We talk about fashion. We do it with love. We do it with passion, man. If that's something you're interested in, don't mind hitting that subscribe button for me. Helps me, helps my channel grow, but yeah. Today I'm excited, man. We have a clone of Parfums the Marley Harriet, which is one of my favorite niche houses. And Harriet is one of my favorite fragrances, man. I love the cherry tobacco that's in that fragrance. The dry down is very smooth, man. Very deep, very sensual, very masculine. You know, like I like to look at myself. A smooth, masculine, sophisticated gentleman with a touch of elegance too. If I had to choose one fragrance from the house of Parfums de Marley to represent me, it would definitely be here. So yo, without further ado, man, we are gonna get straight into the presentation, okay? Like I said, you guys, this is from the house of Mason Alhambra. It comes in this nice silver slash graphite kind of metallic looking bottle. It's not bad, man. The cap on this is a different kind of silver though, you guys, if you can see it. But it's very nice, man. Very heavy, very sturdy. The cap is plastic though, you guys. So it looks like it's metal, but trust me, it's not. Getting on into the atomizer, it is pressurized. And man, oh man, hey. <laughs> This is a great fragrance by itself, you guys. Does it get close to Parfums the Marley Harriet? I'm gonna be honest with you, man. It gets about 80 to 85% close. Reason being, the tobacco in this fragrance right here is not as pungent as the tobacco in Harriet. Mason Alhambra's Hercules is a bit sweeter than Parfums the Marley Harriet, but to me personally, I kind of like this. Now, I'm not saying that it's better than Parfums the Marley Harriet, but what I am saying is that on any given day, I'm susceptible to choosing any fragrance. And hey, on a normal day, I'll probably choose this fragrance if I don't want to wear Parfums the Marley Harriet and waste that expensive juice. Performance on this one, you guys, is like no other. You're getting an easy eight to 10 hours on skin. On clothes, man, hey, you can literally put it on your clothes and the next week you're gonna still smell Hercules. It is that damn good. Projection wise, you guys, this leaves a CI's trail like no other. Literally, I was walking in the store one time. I had already left out of this aisle. I had a lady follow me just to ask me, what am I wearing? And she was in the next aisle over. Yes, it's good. Scent profile wise, you guys, you have that sweet cherry tobacco. Now, while cherry is not a listed note in this fragrance, I do get a hint of cherry, man, somewhere in there. And it's beautiful, man, gorgeous. Like I said, you do have that tobacco note in there. You also have this sort of smokiness to it, man. This is a very mysterious, very classy, alluring, mature kind of fragrance. If you 18 years old, man, I probably wouldn't wear, <laughs> recommend wearing this scent, right? But man, this is for the 23 and up crowd, man. I really wouldn't even say 23, probably 25 and up crowd. You know, you kind of got everything together, but not really, but you're in the right direction, okay? 30 and up crowd, you're definitely gonna love this fragrance, man. I will leave a link down in the description box below where you can purchase this fragrance if you choose to do so. Overall, man, I'm giving Mason Alhambra's Hercules as a fragrance by itself a nine out of 10. In regards to it being the closest clone to Parfums the Marley Harriet, uh, like I said, it gets about 80%, 80 to 85%, man, but it does get you close. Anyways, man, it's your boy Var from 20 Degrees in LA. If you enjoyed this video and you rocking with me, please hit that subscribe button and like this video as well, you guys. Until next time, let's get it.